How did you run a Pokemon Frost Fluff? Welcome back to another episode of The Walking Dead. We're jumping back into the story of Lee trying to get uh, 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 farm folk distracted. And that's what we're going to do. Uh, I was a little lost on what happened last time, so I want to see if I can get some direction from, from good old... Uh, how did he get over there? I thought I went... Ah, whatever. <laughs> In the last episode, Larry went to the right side, and it didn't look like he circled around. So let's just see what old Lily has to say about the whole situation. Okay, I need you to go Lee? hit on Andy or something. Did something happen? Uh, there's something odd in the barn, tell you, huh? be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. I second that completely. Uh, but After we're gonna find out what's going on anyways. I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. What if it's more I'm food? Go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Like, they could have boxes of rice back there. All for the taking. Oh, I have an inventory. I wasn't aware of that. I, uh, how do I activate it, though? That's my question. <gasps> they got code and cotton. We gotta get ourselves some of that. Uh, look at the corn. It's gonna be so exciting. Crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Uh, my question is, where are they getting the water for all this like vegetation and stuff? As far as I know, they don't seem to be near any kind of source of water, unless they're going like 1800 style and have a well somewhere. <laughs> But even so, you gotta top that thing off at some point, right? Hey, Andy! <laughs> okay, he's knocked out. Let's go see what's back there. Hey there, Andy. Yep. Yeah. Right, let's just go with Danny. Danny instead. mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. You A right bandit got him. <laughs> we need you to go rescue him. All right, go lock the door. I want to go get this thing. Come on, Lee. Walk a little faster, buddy. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. That was quick. <laughs> uh, crap. And he keeps coming back. Distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. What about those generators? I was just thinking that, to be honest. I mean, but how do I make it look like an accident? <laughs> uh, let's just see what that does. I'm sure we got a button or two to push. Like that big red one. Let's do that. Alright, we killed it. Now we should unplug stuff. And then he'll be all kinds of distracted. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. Well, I'm glad he gave us that little clue, but how we go about trying to... Look at the gas cans. They're storing gasoline all over the property. That's kind of smart, I guess. Look at the outlet. You definitely tell they built this thing themselves. How long does it take for that food to cook? What, you got takeout? <laughs> Yeah, this DoorDash is just uh, not what it used to be. But by golly, the food's always fresh when it gets here. I don't doubt that at all. On top of that, she was pretty quick on uh, getting that food like cooked up. Uh, so we got any no mail. mail coming in or out these days. At least they don't have to worry about bill collectors anymore. That is so true. Or, uh, you know what? Let's just go back into the, the uh, barn and see if we can get one of the kids. To cause some kind of distraction. We'll get Ducky to do it. Man, it is so dark in there. It just it got darker outside somehow. Uh, cow, what's up? How do you, you like that her? cow, Clint? She's pretty. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Where do you keep your tools? So. Where do you keep the rest of the tools? 
Well, if you need something, just tell me what it is, and I can get it for you. Eh, not that important. Why do you lock that door? Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh, they come down here every once in a while, raid our stuff, even with the fence. Okay. Alrighty then. Alright, I guess, uh... I'm gonna go back to the generator, see if I can... There's another option I can maybe explore. I don't know. I mean, my first guess is, uh... Well, I have that multi-tool for a reason. I can't use the axe because it'd be a little too obvious, so maybe I gotta cut a wire or something? I don't know. We'll cut the blue wire! That's how that works, right? Actually, maybe the second one will, like, blow the engine or something. I knew it! Hold on, let's yeah, just take a peek at that. Uh, Guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. Fortunately, I have one of those. <laughs> it wasn't fastened very well. Uh, cut it, I guess? Ow, damn it! Thing is moving fast! I guess we should <laughs> turn that off. Come on, faster, faster! There, that should do it. Okay, let's let's close that up. Be a little too <laughs> obvious if we just stood in front of the thing. Where did he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a bell. Damn it, all. I was worried we were gonna get caught there. <laughs> Hey, buddy. What's going on there? I was just hanging out by the fence, checking for mail. You know, making sure we get no bills and all. Whoops. Look at the electric fence. No, I'm not going to do that. Let's just uh, go back in the barn. I'll let you do that, and uh, I'm going to go check on old Bessie. If she's not mil uh, producing milk, we're going to be make a steak. Wait, if I recall correctly in the TV show, I think... I think it was in one of the first episodes that the zombies ate a horse? I was going to say, why couldn't they just go, like, to a neighboring farm and, like, steal some cows? But I guess the, uh, zombies are not very picky. <gasps> Mom! Dad! Dinner time! It's Recess. dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Chill out, duck. I need you to fly away now. Go distract the boys. Use the flying V. Quack. 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 <laughs> That's from uh, folks that are familiar with the uh, Mighty Ducks movies. Those things aren't fastened very well. I imagine we could have just pulled those lock off <laughs> come on Kenny I need you to give me a really good reason to time up let's make this quick come on Got cannibals right I know it I knew it <laughs> boy didn't you hear the bell uh Dinner. the door fell open You know what? Well, I can't let my wife blood in there. Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. I mean, that's a pretty good alibi, but I'm um, If that was the case, why do you need to lock the door? And I found some clothes in your barn. Something ain't adding up there, old Andy. Oh, <laughs> Brenda, you are an angel. Biscuit? Wow! Oh, Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. Now go get the meal. 
Oh, Something's off. This yeah. isn't a lot. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Yes, ma'am. I'm just gonna go upstairs real quick. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna... Gotta wash our hands first. Make sure we got a good alibi. Uh, I'm starting to think they're... They probably put something in the food, right? Gauze pads. Like sleeping pills or some kind of knockout agent. Chloroform. Maybe. Oh, no, wait. Didn't mean to do that. I'm just gonna open it up. <sighs> and continue to have people away. Could use a shave. Some kind of lotion. There doesn't seem to be anything else to explore, so we're gonna close that. Why would they have a mirror in that? Make sure I don't miss anything. How do I? I can't seem to wash my hands, so I guess that's not an option. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I saw another door here that we can't get into, obviously. <gasps> this leads somewhere. Mark! Walkers aren't getting through that thing. I mean, if you're gonna be sneaky, at least be a little quicker. Come on, man. They're <laughs> like feet away from. Just peek around, peek around that door. Oh, shit. Uh, caca, caca! That damn raven came back. <laughs> He's the one that messed up the generator. I gotta go. Come on. And open. Oh, this is lame. It's gotta be a hidden compartment, though. If a wire, especially if a wire's just hanging in. Uh, morphine. What do they need so much morphine for? Knocking people out. Candles. Smart. Musty as hell. Medical spot. Guess someone needed some first aid recently. Uh, something's going on yeah. with that. What is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? All right, well, let's see where this hidden compartment goes. What the hell? I really hope Mark's okay. Because <laughs> he was ex-military, right? We need that kind of personnel on the crew. Actually, we didn't know him too well, so I guess if he dies, it wouldn't be the worst thing. Okay, moment of truth. Ooh. Let's just take a peek around. I know I should be quick, but I don't want to miss anything. He was up here resting. Is that blood? Darn skippy it is. Farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. All right, well, let's just see where that goes. Probably to a hidden kitchen, right? Behind a hidden door. <gasps> My video game experience tells me there's loot in here. And open. Come on, Lee Spartan Kick. You should have at least closed the door to the bedroom. Oh my god. He's still alive! <laughs> Mark. What the <laughs> Brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? God. Eat dinner. Hey. I knew it. <laughs> Clementine. Okay, 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 I gotta get to get before she eats. Come on, let's go. We probably got seconds. Come on, go. What are you waiting for? Woo. <laughs> Don't eat that! Don't eat that! Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. It 
didn't human meat? Be this way. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Okay. I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? Uh, Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. Just let us go. Let us go. Oh, man. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways. One way or another. Like y'all. Can he get your gun? Can he get your gun? Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking what? Put fuck? your guns down! <laughs> We're walking out of here! Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. Please? Oh no! Mother hugger. Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Ooh boy, Mark's uh I don't know how he didn't bleed out. His legs weren't like bandaged at all. At least he died and he's a walker now. Whoa! I didn't think things were gonna escalate that quickly. I knew I had my suspicions for sure. You can't keep us in here. Open up! I will tear you fuckers apart with my bare hands. We gotta find another way out of here. Yo, shit, fucking bastards! Open this door, god damn it! I will knock the goddamn door down. It was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet... Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. <laughs> You'd have made the whole thing if I hadn't done that in the first place. Uh... You okay, Clementine? They... they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm-mm. Oh, Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn thumb sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna Yeah, Larry, chill out. Me. You were the one sucking up to them. <laughs> so, uh, let's God, try to be calm about this. Who boy, things took a turn for, uh... Well, a drastic turn in general. <laughs> but I think that's what I'm gonna call it for this episode, folks. Uh, I guess we'll just have to find out what happens in the next episode. Uh, again, thanks for coming to my piece of the internet today, and uh, be appreciative. Drop the like on the video, comment what you like, didn't like, what you want to see in the future, and uh, until next time, folks. Have a good one.